What's going on, dudes and dudettes? Welcome back to All of Fabric 4. We're greeted here with a friend. I was, well, he agreed. I was not expecting to see him. So let's see, what do you got? Um, nothing. Well, emeralds would be nice, but we don't really have that. Yeah, I don't have it, so shoot. Uh, anyways, guys, we're going to be getting into the drill today from Industrial Revolution. This guy here, the Mining Drill Mark 1. We definitely, definitely want this guy. But we have a few machines to make before that, including this hammer, which is going to be our best friend for a while. Uh, so let's go ahead and make that hammer real quick. Uh, this is going to allow us to make some plates. Perfect. All right, so we're going to need to make three different machines here. Uh, the first being the coal generator. This is going to produce power for the other two machines. Uh, so we need to go ahead and get this made. So we need some heat coils. Uh, yeah, we're going to need a lot of uh, copper plates here. So all we got to do is combine those together. And we've already used all of the hammer. I did not realize the hammer durability would be that low. Oh, well. So we got a few of those. Uh, we just need two of these, so we're good. Those don't stack, okay. So what about you, what do we need? Copper plates, a gold plate, okay. We do have some gold. I assume we're gonna need more than just one, so we're gonna make three. Perfect, and then we need some Nicolite. You can find this stuff down. I found it at my mine, it's at Y level 11. It's pretty much everywhere. Uh, just kind of looks like a Cyan turquoise-ish redstone blocks. It's super easy to find. All right, so we're just gonna make one for now. Perfect. It's really happy about that. Uh, we need to make this machine block here. Okay, so we're gonna need to make some iron plates. We're running pretty low on iron. All right. Yep. So there we go. Machine block. And then just a battery, which is going to require some tin. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so just five tin. Okay. The battery, there we go. That should be the coal generator. So cool. We got power at our fingertips. Unlimited power. Itty bitty living space. One block. All right. So there we go, generating LF, which is interesting. Does this continue to heat? Is it gonna keep burning or is it stopped? I think it's stopped, so that's good. It's only gonna use the, the power that we need. You are annoying, my friend. Oh, zoom. <laughs> oh, he agreed. Hey, it's a rat. Okay. Oh, we're good. So, uh, now that we have the coal generator made, we can go ahead and make the... Uh, we're going to actually need to make the solid infuser first. Um, so, let's go ahead and make him real quick. We'll start off with the glass. All right, we're gonna need some more copper plates. We got plenty of copper plates. Uh, we're gonna need six more iron. Oof, we are running low. All right, there's our machine block. We need more tin. Do we have enough tin? We actually do, and I also found out what's causing that um, this pop-up to appear. If you hold shift and hit E, this pops up. So I'm not too sure how to disable that as it's not set to a specific key, which is kind of annoying. Well, I mean kind of, I mean like maximum annoyance. So yeah. Uh, but we will need to find one more iron ingot. I don't believe I have any made, which is kind of a bummer. Okay. So now that that's done, should be, nope, we need one more. So let's do that. Turn all of those into plates. 
Make ourselves a battery. Need to make one of these. All right, so we have our solid infuser. Perfect. All right, so that will allow us to create bronze now. Um, if we look here at the bronze dust, we have to combine copper dust and tin dust. Now, I think the only way to make this, yeah, is pulverizing. Oof, but... One to three, not bad. Uh, so we need to make a, a pulverizer next. Gonna have to make the Mark One pulverizer. Okay, so we're definitely gonna need some more iron. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and go mining for a bit longer, get some more iron, and then that's pretty much all we need. Also, nope, we have everything for, yeah, so all we need to do is that, what if, does it have to be the dust? Um, so tin and copper. Let's see. Okay, yep, it has to be the dust. So I will be back in a little bit. I'm going to go mining down here in the cave. Hopefully we get some more iron enough to build another pick, and then we'll be back. All right, so we went ahead and found 12 more iron ingots. Also had to switch to a... Oh, is there a different hammer we can use? I did not anticipate that. Um, I don't think there's another hammer that we can use. We have to use this one, ah, which means we don't have enough iron to do this. Well, baby steps, baby steps, right? Baby steps, I guess. Okay, so pulverizer is the thing that we need next, uh, which does require those plates that we made, which is okay. Um, we're only short three, so that shouldn't be too difficult to find some more, even though iron is super scarce at this point. So I'm going to break this a few times, see if we can get some flint. Look at that, I already got it. I just remembered we had vein miner, and I didn't need to really do that. That is okay. So... Alright, we got that, we need this. Um... All of those materials. Oh my gosh. I'm done. All right. Now that that's over, we got two leads and uh, three leather. So that's that's fantastic. Uh, it's great for our cause, uh, you know, so our ears aren't bleeding anymore. Okay. Pulverizer. We got the machine block here. We got the MK1 circuit. We need more tin. All right, so we're also going to need to find some more tin as well. That's not a big deal. Everything is super duper scarce at the beginning of these mod packs. Uh, and then there's always that one moment where it, you just seem to kind of break through. And the, the mod pack becomes super easy. So we'll, we'll see when we get to that point. Okay. So I'm going to get some copper pulverized up here. All right, and of course these, uh, you can like upgrade these to the next tier. It looks like there are upgrade slots available, uh, so we can make this even faster, which is definitely going to be nice later on when we have a lot more stuff to process. Okay, now that the tin is done, oh, we have more tin there i didn't realize that okay so we're gonna combine those together and that should give us bronze 
Uh, now we're actually going to need to get one more of each. So I'm glad I did simple math. We're going to need a total of four to get the drill. Or not. We actually didn't need that much. <laughs> we made more than we needed. Why? Oh, well. Okay, so we have the bronze dust here. I believe all we need to do is just smelt it now. Yep, that'll turn into the ingots, and all we got to do is get the compressor for it. Uh, the reason is because we cannot use the hammer on bronze. I think it's a little bit too hard if that makes sense to you guys. Uh, so we need to go ahead and get everything we need for this guy. What can we craft? Um... We need some more copper plates here. So let's get this guy created. We cannot make the machine frame. Uh, we cannot make the battery. Okay, so we need tin and copper and we got it. I'm also gonna get some cobblestone smelting here because we will need that in a little bit. All right, so I'm gonna do some more mining and we'll be back in a little bit, guys. All right, we are in the final stretch of the a drill here. Uh, all we gotta go ahead and do, we got the machine frame that we needed. Uh, what else do we need? Oh, we probably need, yeah, some more tin. Uh, should have some tin here. Yes, we got lots of tin. Four, five, I guess we'll have to just make all of them. I don't see any of the tin plates. Okay, so here we go, battery. And then we should have some of this, what are we missing, what are we missing? Oh, the copper plates. All right, oops, and booyah, compressor, perfect. All right, so now we can take those brawn ingots that we had and we can compress them down into the plates. So cool. All right, so that can go off of our menu. Now we just need to work on the drill. Uh, so that's why we made all of that smooth stone there. Uh, we don't need it anymore uh, or any extra. We have the two nickelite. Yep, two nickelite. You, well, we're going to need a little bit more nickelite in our inventory. So we're going to need to make another plate here. Gold plate, there we go. All right, and then some more copper. One, two, three, four. Come on, click it. There we go. And then one more battery. Oh, we really only have four plates. We need five. Oh, son of a... All right, we can just make one more plate in the compressor. Cool thing is we have all of the materials. We'll have the battery after this. Uh, so we don't need to go any more mining without the mining drill, which is what I'm super duper excited about. Now, I believe we do have the ability to affect the area of effect on that or to increase the area of effect, which is what we're going to want. Uh, so let's go ahead and create our drill. Here we go. Bam, the mining drill is ours. How do we charge it? <laughs> uh, uses. Is there a charger? Portable charger. What about charge? Charge pad. Oh my gosh. Yeah, we're not getting close to that yet. Um,. Yeah, that's even further away. Like an energy cell. Okay. That's an electric lift. Let me do some reading real quick and figure out how we're supposed to charge this guy. 
All right, so we now have the ability to uh, create the flux container, which is going to go ahead and charge up our system uh, or our, our miner, whatever it's called thing here. What the? Why aren't you getting any power, buddy? Hey, uh, do you need to be on the front? Oh, my pickaxe broke. Hmm. Okay. Where if we put you here? What the frick? Just pump out power, please. Pump out power, please. Alright, let's try to make some Mark 1 cables. Uh, we should have everything for that. Um, yeah, that be kind of lame though if we if we couldn't utilize this thing because we really need to to utilize this thing okay so i'm just gonna take take it like this all right pulverizer What happens if we just chuck the drill in? Is it like a visual glitch? I did it again. Visual glitch here. Now it legitimately isn't filling with power. Is there a wrench that we need? A wrench. Copper, copper, copper. We can make that. All right, copper wrench, or really just a wrench has been made. Um, <gasps> we mined it. Okay, so that's filling up with power now. Good. All right, we can put that in there. That's working. I believe those will be receiving power. There we go, looking beautiful. And bam, our mining laser is fully charged. Perfect, let's go down here and see what happens when we use it. All right, so it's just like a normal mining drill. I don't know if there's an ability to add in like an area of effect, I assume there would be. Otherwise, it's just kind of like a lame pickaxe that you just recharge. So, let's see here. Okay, so I've got the Revolutionary Guide, oh, which is the basic book for the um, Industrial Revolution. It tells us about all the ores, the machines, um, tools, mining drill. Okay, so each of these is actually, yeah, we're going to have to work on getting up to the next tier. Uh, mining drill mark three and then the modular one which is the one we eventually want because this one will allow us to mine that three by three area uh, but until then uh, we won't be able to uh, but we will be able to you know do some average mining and i do believe we have some hammers available yeah um Let's see, do we have like a, a stone one we can make real quick? A stone hammer? Yeah. Let's go ahead and test this guy out. I think this might be what we're looking for. If not, you know, it's stone, so it's not just a big deal. No, but we definitely want to mine a 3x3 three three section out. I just think that's going to be fantastic. Um, so let's see here. Oh, I think we need two of the stone. Yeah, we need two of the smooth stone, one of the cobble. Okay. So there we go. All right, so we got the hammer here, rock solid hammer. So it definitely wanted us to make it, uh, but let's see why it wanted us to make it. Oh, 
Oh yes, <laughs> this is exactly what we want. So, as much as I hate to say it, I'm going to be using the stone hammer. Well, I'm going to be using the stone hammer and the mining drill because I believe harvest level. Um, so you got to put it up higher. I actually think it, it doesn't have a, a pretty high harvest level, so we're not really going to be able to use it very efficiently. But we do have 14 diamonds, which, if we look here, is not enough to make a hammer. <laughs> all right, but anyways, guys, we're going to wrap up the episode for today. Thank you all so much for watching. I love your faces. I will see you all in the next video. Take care. Peace out. Bye-bye.